fromage fry. It's me again, and in this one, I'm going to be comparing these two. And these are Mars, obviously, against Morrison's equivalent, the Apollo Bar. Now, I have had these, and I, I do know what these are like. So I won't, I'll try not to give my opinion of them until we get to the eating bit. So let's have a look at the facts first. So what we got here, so we've got, these are the little multi-pack ones, which, I mean, can you even buy a proper Mars bar now? And when I was a kid, you know, people will say, yeah, but you were a kid then, your hands were a lot smaller, they seemed bigger, which is true. But I remember being a teenager, the height I am now. Um, and that, they were miles bigger than what we you can buy them now. I don't know what size they were, but these are ridiculously small. So I don't even know what size is the biggest one you can buy now. But anyway, these ones are four times 39.4 grams. And I think these are 38 gram ones. Yeah, four times 38 grams. So we've got a total of 152 grams in this one, 157.6 grams in the real Mars ones. So cost, where is the cost? So £1.65 for them, £1.15 for them. So not a massive difference. £1.05 pence per 100 grams. 75.7 .7 pence per 100 grams. So these are round about three, quar three quarters of the price of that. So it's not massively different. Right, okay. Let's get them open. And let's get have a taste on them. Although I've had these before, I've never tasted them side by side with these ones. Oh, they're tiny. These remind me, of the, although bigger, they remind me of them. Well, I think they, they're like the celebration. Is it celebrations? What you get in your tubs, you buy them at Christmas normally, don't you? But they remind, <laughs> remind me of them a bit. Obviously bigger, but... It's so flipping small now. So obviously the brand and similar. But they're not, they're not shy, are they? they? They do actually just go as close as they can. But that is taking the mickey a bit, isn't it, really? I mean, it is. They've literally got a bag of this and said, right, let's copy it. Let's get as close to that as we can. The only thing slightly different, which is surprising, really, the colouring of the fonts is a little bit different. This is red and that's more orange. You'd think they'd get that bit right, wouldn't you? Anyway, here we go. Wow. Wow. Huh? This is supposed to be just about, this, I think this one's one gram heavier than this one. It's tiny. This is way bigger than this. I'm going to have to get them out of the packet. Right. So we'll keep the Mars one. Well, I don't think that'll be difficult to distinguish the two, but we will... Do this. Hopefully you can see them. Wow. Wow. I really should. I should have got my scales out, but they're behind me. Um. I mean, to be fair, they do feel the same weight. 
But look. They're about the same width. And there ain't a lot in the Look. So that's a bit deceiving. If you was to look at that and and someone said to you, right, that one weighs 38 grams, what do you reckon this one weighs? You'd say, Phew, getting up towards 50. You can see that's, that's a quarter as big again, nearly. A fifth anyway. You'd say, Phew, about 50 grams. 39.6 or 7, was it? Where is it? 39.4 grams. Right, okay. Let's try this one first. Yeah. Still tastes just like it did when I was a kid. Loved Mars bars as a kid. Now, another thing I should mention, when I do buy these, or when I have bought them, I should say, um, I normally keep them in the fridge. Now, I've deliberately left these out of the fridge because I do think they taste better when they're room temperature. So let's see what this tastes like now. Wow, that is completely different. That's completely different to when that's in the fridge. I'm having a hard time telling the difference between these. Let me have a drink. People say, oh, you never had a drink. They're very similar. I think there's a bit more flavour in that, just a little bit more. The chocolate's obviously a better flavour. I don't know. I mean, do do they even tell you who make their chocolate? Morrison's. Is it even a, a known brand? But obviously you've got the slightly better taste. I mean, this is high quality chocolate. When I say high quality, I mean compared to this. It doesn't taste like cheap old chocolate. So they used a, a good standard of chocolate to mimic this. But I think the chocolate is slightly better. It does taste slightly better on the Mars. And I think there is just a little bit more caramel flavour there when you're eating it. You're getting a little bit more caramel flavour coming through. But as for the nugget, or the nougat, what, what do you call it? The nougat, there, there's no difference on that. Wow, that's really surprised me, and I, I will tell you why, I don't think I'll ruin a video when I do the Tesco one, because I, I do normally buy these um, little bars, bars of chocolate, and I had 
had the Marsons one a couple of times. And then I picked up the Tesco's one. And I found the Tesco's one I liked a lot better than this one. So I'm wondering, <laughs> is the Tesco one got to taste better than the actual Mars one? But I do always keep them in the fridge. So maybe it's something to do with... I'm... Draw, I've got memories of eating these as a kid. You know what like. You're out on your bike with your mates. You go in the shop. You get a Mars bar. So they're always going to be nice and soft. They're not going to be cool. You take them off a shelf in the shop. You don't take them out of the fridge. So I've got memories of having these like this. So when I've been having them out of the fridge and they're quite hard, I've always thought they're not very good. Nah. But, we do the same with the Tesco one. But I always feel the Tesco one's better. So I've been buying Tesco ones lately. I haven't been picking these ones up. Right, let's wrap this video up. Now, I've got, to, I've got to say, so basically, how I wrap these uh, these comparison video up is I basically, would I buy the original or would I buy the copycat? Or would I alternate? Because they're quite, like, when it comes to price, value, taste and everything, are they sort of equally matched? And I might buy that one one day and that one another day. I think I would hardly ever buy that one. And this is probably why the price is 75% of that. It's quite high, really. For a copycat product, 75% of the original is quite up there. So... But it is very close on taste, flavour, weight. Although this one did appear to be a lot bigger, weight-wise, I, I mean, I should have weighed them, really, but they should be the same, or bar 1.4 grams. So, overall, unless I can pick them up on a silly deal, I would buy them once. So there we are, guys. We'll wrap the video up there. So, guys, what do you do? You buy these products? Do you stick to the original? Do you buy these ones, or do you buy another supermarket's ones? Get in the comments. Let let me know, and let me know what you think of them. So there we are, guys. That is another comparison video. Thanks for watching, and I hope you'll join me. <laughs> <laughs> He's right behind me <laughs> again soon on another video. Take care, guys. Right, come on then. Let's get you treated up. And then we've got we've got to film his review next. Next week's review, which will be going out. When's that going out? Oh no, that'll be the week before. So yeah, the week before this went out is the video is now what we're filming. Here we are, Bobo. -bo. Uh, I don't know why I'm treating him. He's now got to be tucking into a load of blooming cat food. Right, that's it, Bobo. -bo. That's it, good lad. Get out of the way of that thing. He know better now. There we go. Right, that's gone. So when I come back, it's going to land on the answer to this question, Bobo. -bo. And the question is, in what year were Mars bars launched? Nice and easy. In what year, well, easy if you know the answer, eh? In what year were, were Mars bars launched? Was it A, 1912, B, 1932, or C, 1952? A, 1912, B, 1932, or C, 1952? 
If you knew the answer to that, get in the comments, let me know. Catch you on the next one, guys. All right.